Okay guys, we're back at the auction this week and we got an interesting mix of stuff. So we'll take you along here and show you what we got. I did see this set of stainless flatware. I'm trying to see what it says. So you'll probably be interested in that. Some art supplies. A set of Cutco knives. Some interesting stuff on this table. Hmm. Interesting candle. Maybe that. We'll see how it smells. Guys, look at these old records. They're pretty pretty interesting. Cool little globe there. Let me come over here and we got some interesting primitive things. Some old chairs. Some toys, old wooden toys, some lamps. This, I think, is a wasp keeper. A dome for plants. Let me go down here. Some old Barbies. Let's check these out. And some hankies. Let's see anything good. Oh, ladybug hanky's pretty good. That's not bad. We'll keep an eye on that box. Let's go over here. Some interesting things, some Harley tanks. That's pretty badly stained. Let's see who makes that one? Rachel Roy, never heard of that. Sarah might like this one, let's see. The great black and white one. No name. We've had these before. These sell pretty well. We'll have to check that out a little bit more. Neat collection of high birds. So China, some oil lamps. Some hand painted Nippon type stuff. And guys, if you're seeing stuff on these videos that you would be interested in, let me know. I'm always looking to expand into another arena of things, so feel free. But lots of primitive items. Check out over here. Holy ball gloves. Somebody had a massive collection of these. There's just a ton of them. This particular lot had a massive collection of everything here. When I turn you around in a minute, we're going to see, I mean, how many pork sausage tins do you need in a lifetime? There's, just to give you an idea, there's four high, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, say 20. So it's 80 of these things. That's some commitment. But look at them, they're just... And it cracks me up to think that your sausage used to come in a metal tin. But then we have some other things. These cool old McCormick tea bag tins. some maple syrup tins, and then, just to give you an idea, we have some more lunchbox. We have the Dukes of Hazard. 
have Maxwell House thermoses, all sorts of interesting old thermoses. Howdy Doody. I'll look at them all. Dukes of Hazard, like I said. Do they have the thermos? They do. And guys, look, they seem to be autographed. There's Gunsmoke, Gene Autry, Bonanza. Oh, this one's cool, the Monsters. Oh, yeah. Beverly Hillbillies. Oh, I like this one. I used to love James Bond when I was a kid. Well, can I get this open? Yes, I can. Oh, it does have the thermos. Uh-oh. Do I need it? Do I want it? This is a really good collection. These are all metal. The Flying Nun, Flintstones, Yogi Bear, Popeye. Some old kids' books and magazines. Here's some Lager Burger. Like I said, every week we get some Lager Burger. All sorts of interesting stuff. I like these little guys here. They seem to be in pretty good shape. This is kind of interesting too. We'll have to see what that goes for. Really interested in this double decker carousel. I'm going to check that out to see what that goes for. If you like the shell, we got this too. Nice assortment of teacups. We do get the Hummels from time to time. I might be interested in this concertina too. They sell pretty well. What is this? Looks like a, some kind of musical glass pumpkin. This is really cool. This tin is to make giant Hershey bars. There's some Hershey advertisements. Kind of go back over here to these cookie cutters. They're pretty cool. And over here we have a bunch of stuff. Somebody like the Giants. Let's see. All sorts of t-shirts and sweatshirts. What is this thing? Some kind of, let me spin it around here. Solid cologne. Some kind of advertising. That's kind of interesting. Got some stains on it, but it's an older piece. S trucks. Now these I really like. They are Red Wing. Still has the original label on it. So we'll have to see what they go for. Holy skeleton keys. If my Beth, my friend Beth comes, she'll be getting those. Let's go over here. More has trucks. Old pillar cases. I'm a sucker for those. And this is pretty cool too. Yeah. So there's what we have for this week. Give you an overview here. Still got to show you the furniture. Might take you over to the box hot room. There's a creepy guy for you. But again, this is this week's auction. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, guys, here's the box hot room. As you can see, we have a whole slew of tables there full of tools. And just to give you an idea, 
we got all sorts of stuff. So we'll just kind of walk down through here, see what we find. Got some wreaths. Just a whole box of wreaths. Some some stuff. Thought it took a few better days. Where if you guys need useful stuff, this is the place to come. That Benatar. Some useful kitchen stuff. Box of newer toys. Useful baking things, more baking things, DVDs, stuffed animals, a ton of Monopoly. Somebody likes the Monopoly. Some really cool frames, glassware. More glassware. Box of sunglasses. Let's see, all brand new sunglasses. Artwork. A rose and velvet. Oops. 45s. Records, all sorts of stuff. Silver plate, a record player, some kitchen stuff. I had to cut it short there. The furnace makes a really loud squealing noise. So, so as you can see, there's lots of just everyday stuff. just to give you an idea. Now here's some of the furniture we're selling tonight. This very cool 70s couch and chair set. Some other things. This great gold velvet chair. Nice hardwood furniture. Like I said, if you need to set up a house for a young person or somebody starting from scratch, this is the place to be. There's some really great stuff. These look really cool. These teak folding chairs. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Even got the stove. Now this lot is what I really like. If I had space for this, this is a fantastic mid-century bar. I mean, come on, that's amazing. Look at the front of it. It's fantastic. But really neat table and chairs. This one even has a pad on top of it, so it's protected. I spy back there a really cool mirror. I have to look at that. Okay, we have more cool selling stands. Really nice maroon rug there. Cherry furniture, quilt stand, even a shopping cart. If you like the trunks, got a whole bunch of trunks. Some great Victorian furniture, marble top stands. Look at this crushed velvet thing back there. That great sideboard with the needlework through there. 
a lot of nice stuff. That's an amazing piece. That's all needlework. Same with that up there. I'm not sure if that's what you call it, but it's tiny hooked. Same with this piece here. We got some interesting items in this slot here. Rocking chairs, maple dining set, a nice maple chest of drawers there. Very cool wicker rocker. I saw something down here I'm gonna tap the bit on. Needlepoint mushrooms. Display cabinet, and then this very cool screen. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like what you see, please like, comment, subscribe, tell people about it, share it with your friends, and stay tuned for more videos.